Estamos reunidos en la presencia de Dios y de estos testigos para solemnizar ante el Dios Todopoderoso y en nombre de nuestra iglesia el contrato matrimonial que este hombre y esta mujer han celebrado ante las autoridades civiles y lo manifiestan ante mí, ministro del Señor y de todos ustedes. There's something that I love to do is tell you how beautiful you are, and you look astonishing. As I look into your eyes, all I can say is that God is good. Si no fuera por su misericordia, no estuviéramos aquí, pero lo logramos. We made it. Gracias a Dios. I thank God for allowing me to have met someone as amazing as you. Thank you for always trying your best in understanding me, for looking at me with no judgment, for teaching me to love myself more, for always pushing me to be the best that I can be. But overall, thank you for loving me, and you inspire me every day to be a better person. To my husband, we have finally made it. Um, words will never express how happy I am in this very moment. The love I have for you is so big that it made it hard to put it on paper. I never thought that we would get to this point, and yet here we are. I promise to love you, honor you, respect you, be faithful to you, support you, be your partner in crime, and in ministry, and be your best friend. I want you to know that I'm in love with you, and that I would do anything for you. And as we enter this new chapter in our lives, I promise to respect you. I promise to honor you, to cherish you. Prometo a cuidarte, a guardarte, y protegerte, y serte fiel. Pero sobre todo amarte como Cristo amó a la iglesia. Aunque no soy perfecto, con la ayuda del Señor prometo darte lo mejor de mí. People would say that today's dream come true, but the truth is that you were always my dream. And I finally have you. Te amo, mi amor. I promise to be the best mother to our children, to instruct them in the ways of the Lord, and mold our families the way God intended. And though we have no children yet, today we start our new family, you and me. I cannot wait to live the rest of my days with you by my side. Today I take your last name, and I leave mine behind because after today I will belong to you till the rest of time. I love you. Quiero ir a la declaración final donde podemos decir declaramos a este hombre y a esta mujer esposo y esposa hasta que la muerte los separe. Pueden besar. Les presento al, a la nueva familia del matrimonio Miguel Ángel y Lian de León. Lian, it has been such a wonderful experience seeing you love my brother the way he deserves to be loved. I'm so happy to finally have a sister to call my own. I love you. Miguel, a true man of God, a great friend the best brother, and now a wonderful husband. I hope you know that every day with you is a gift and that I am forever proud to be your sister. I love you. You're an amazing sister, and I'm so beyond blessed to have you not only as a role model in my day-to-day -day life, but as a role model in my walk with the Lord. I love you so much, and I can't wait to see what God has in his plans for you guys. And I want to leave you with a quick verse, John 15, 12, where it says, My command is this, love each other as I have loved you. Congratulations. Who was the first one to say, I love you? ¿Quién fue quien dijo, te amo primero? Leah. I'm extremely grateful to have the both of you in my life. Happy to have had the opportunity to watch you guys grow and mature not only individually but together as a couple. I, for one, will always be here for you when you need me, chaperone duty or not. As I make this toast, I wish upon you guys the very best and hope that you guys continue embarking in the journey that is marriage and to always remember that with God in the center, everything is possible. So, Miguel and Leanne, 